Hi everyone, this is Julia Doty from Green Umbrella. Um, I've got an education slot for the social media club this week. Um, it's just literally how to embed a video from Facebook and also embed a tweet, um, any tweet that you want to, into your WordPress website. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to very quickly show you how to do it. So let's start. I'll do the Twitter one first. So um, if you look down your feed and you find the tweet that you want, it's really easy to do. Um, so say we want to embed this uh, gotta love a bit of coffee art. Um, all we're going to do is come away here. See where it sees these little three dots? So if we click there, underneath it says embed tweet. So we're going to copy that. And you've got all this gobbledygook, um, which is called a script. So what we're going to do is right click on that script and we're going to copy it. OK, and that's the code that creates this whole tweet. All right. But we're going to copy and paste that into our website. There's a certain area where you actually do that. So I'm going to show you that now. So bear with me two seconds. OK, so whether you go, we can now go on to um, WordPress and there's going to be you, either you can do it as a page or you can do it as a post, as in like a, a WordPress post. Um, and all you have to do is you say this is the test. So I'm just going to show you how to do it. The key to it, that gobbledygook um, HTML, which we call it, um, you've got two tabs over here. So you've got a visual tab, which is the default, which is what you uh, mostly use. And then you've got another one called text. OK, if I just post it while I'm on visual. OK, and save that as a draft. So that's just that gobbledygook code. Um, when I go to view the page. This will take a second or two. Now, if I go to view the page, it will also just look a little bit like gobbledygook. OK, we don't want it to look like that. We actually want it to look like the tweet. So we'll go back into edit page. And what you have to do is rather than doing it on that text tab, so you've got the tab here, sorry, visual tab, we now want to be doing it on the text tab. Why they don't call that tab HTML or script or code or something like that, I don't know, because to me it's not text, but anyway. Uh, so we'll go over to the text and again we'll paste it in there. So I'm just right clicking and pasting or control V if you're on a Mac. So let's save that. And now if I preview it, because we've done it on this tab, it will then transfer it into code. So it's just saving at the moment. It's taking a second or two. So let's see if it works. Go ahead and click view page. Hey, and you see it's transferred that code into my little tweet there. OK, so that's taking embedded code and you get embedded code in all different sorts of places, whether it's on YouTube, you can embed a video, uh, Getty images, you know, you can embed all sorts of free images into your site. There's loads of things. If you see that magic work in word embed code, when you're on your WordPress website, you just need to make sure that you're doing it on that text tab, you know, not the visual tab. OK, so you need to make sure that you're doing it on this tab over here. OK, if you want to embed then a Facebook video, um, this is a little bit more complicated. So if you're going on to videos and um, the say social media examiner doing these really good videos, and I'm putting those onto our um, coaching club website once a week because they do some quite handy ones. So yeah, why reinvent the wheel and create another video when they're doing quite good ones already? So let's say, for example, this week's is a hot tip um, how to force a Facebook tag in a post. So we're going to click on there. And I want to actually share this video on my website. So for do to do that, I can either take the link, but then people will click on it and they're taken away from my website to here to watch the video. What I really want them to do is actually watch that video inside my website. And the best way to do that is you go into the video. You see you've got this little options tab here. So if you click options and then you click embed post, it's that magic work embed. And here is the script or the gobbledygook. So we want to copy that. OK, go back onto our website. And don't forget we're in the text field now. So if I'll come down. And I'm just going to put some little spaces. OK, and I'm going to right click. Let's show you a right click. And I'm going to paste. And that gobbledygook goes in there. So we'll save draft.
this is a bit longer because it takes a while to stream so and then if I click view page okay I you see I've got my tweet there and then underneath is my video and I can actually click play in the video and it will play that video directly from my website rather than drawing people back to the Facebook page so I'm keeping people on my website anyway I hope that helps embedded a tweet and embed embed a video from Facebook into your WordPress website that's me signing out for another day hope that helps see you soon take care ta-da